Hello and welcome back to the No Moving Masters League. Uh, I mentioned this in my map battle video, but once again, uh, I'd like to apologize for missing last week. Uh, what happened was I had uh, a laptop and it was all I had. And it was an old laptop that wasn't very suitable for recording and it could not handle the recording, so I just I couldn't record. Uh, was, yeah, I didn't have access to a better computer, so that is what happened. But uh, I'll have you know that last week did not go very well. I played Epic Duchy. I still don't know who Epic Duchy is, but he's still doing extremely well. Uh, so he beat me by about 5,000 points in, I've already forgotten, uh, a mountainous world. So it was a world map that I lost. <clears throat> And yeah, it was a pretty tricky seed. Um, and the other game was against Boxa in Argentina. And Argentina is a country I had no time to practice. And it's a country where, well, the more you practice, the more the better you're going to do. And I found that out the hard way. Uh, I just had no idea what I was doing. And Argentina is one of my worst countries already. No, no moving so. Uh, I didn't stand a chance, but I feel like even if I practiced, I probably would have been in trouble, because he beat me by almost 10k. So, that has me down here in 12th, although I've played fewer games than most of the people around me, um, because I'm playing late this week. So, hopefully, I can at least climb out of the relegation zone uh, after this, but we're going to see about that. So, I'm playing Len the Man, and I'm playing Zigzag. Uh, Len the Man, uh, it's, a, it's a world map, but he's a very good player who does super well on like all the practice seeds and everything, so he's a bit scary. And then Zigzag is also quite a solid player and a uh, fellow YouTuber. And I'm playing him in Kyrgyzstan, uh, another country where it's immensely beneficial to practice, and I've practiced very little, so I feel like I could be in trouble there as well. But we're going to see. So, I'm going to jump straight in now. First, we have Remote World against Land the Man. Without further ado, let's go. Okay, so first we have Canada, and this is no far north Canada. But I suck at distinguishing Yukon from Northwest Territories, because they look the same to me. And it kind of matters here which one this ends up being. And I don't know which one I want to go for. I know it's one of the two. I'm fairly certain with the Gen 2 coverage and just the, the way it looks. But there's so much distance here between like these Yukon rows and the, the roads over here. That I have to say I'm pretty darn worried about this. I th I'm leaning Northwest Territories for no particular reason, but I kind of want to just like plop it around here somewhere, maybe. I think that's what I'm going to go for here. Yeah, I'm just going to pull the trigger. What? Wow, really? Okay, well, I was completely wrong then. <clears throat> My bad. Now, he was farther away than me, so I've actually got a small lead here. But that is surprising. I mean, I get, I, these sort of top halves of the, like, prairie provinces definitely can look like that. I just usually don't think about them. Usually when I see a, a landscape like that, it usually ends up being up here. So that felt very similar to what you see uh, further up north like that. So that's kind of surprising. To see, uh, to see it be where it was, but no big deal. And now we have Russia. Yeah, see, this is... Oh, God. This is terrible. It's just going to be five rounds of this. These just giant countries that are so hard to, to guess. Because I'm only up by 500 points, which is nothing on a map like this. All it takes is a bad guess, and I, um, well, I'm a little worried I'm going to end up with a bad guess here. 
feels more Western to me. Kind of feels sort of Baltic-ish. I'm kind of thinking I'll guess in this kind of area. But I'm, you know, it could literally end up being like Vladivostok or something. So, I, I'm not a very good Russia no-moving player. So, this definitely could be a problem. But I've got nothing else, so I am going to guess kind of this neck of the woods. Just put it like right there. And hopefully this is close enough. Oh my god. See, yeah, see, and now I'm behind. Because he decided he would guess like, I don't know, over here somewhere. And it ended up being like really far east. And I just don't know how I'm supposed to know that. Oh dear. Okay. Down by about 700 now. That's a shame. Uh, okay, well Iceland is easier to recognize. Uh, but it's never easy to get points. So we have water. Thinking we're maybe in the east. Some sort of river here. This is interesting. I wonder if it's actually findable. It probably is, but I'm not sure what the best way is to go about this. Basically north, river to the east, water to the north. Um, is it ever something like this? Man, I don't know. Maybe it's here. Wow, no, that's wrong. River's too wide, that doesn't make sense. I'm gonna go for it anyway. Ah, okay. What? Are you kidding me? How did he do that? Well, he was super close, somehow. I mean, the river didn't even show up, but... Okay, sure. So now I'm behind by a solid thousand. Which is still not a lot, especially with whatever we're looking at here. Oh no. God, I have no idea. What? Nothing's even coming to mind here. Is this Argentina, maybe? Maybe it is Argentina. This is, this is a weird one. Could even be Uruguay, couldn't it? trying to reason this one out. I'm actually going to go Uruguay, which is maybe a controversial thing to do, but yeah, I'm doing it. Nice. Let's go. Ooh, okay, it's close now. Well, that was a nice guess. And I'm within almost 100, which is draw territory. So it all comes down to this last round. Oh no. Oh no 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 no. What is this? 
Uh, it would be so nice if I could see any of these things clearly. Why can't I tell if this is Europe or Australia? <laughs> it's got to be Australia, right, with the trees? Look this way, and it looks European, but... <clears throat> I think it's Australia, which is bad. Because I'm a horrible... Australia... player. Ah, uh, man. Wow, I really don't know. This is a weird location. Is it just, like, down here? I mean... Just gotta go in this like green area. It's not that mountainous though, is it? I'm gonna, just gonna go here. Oh my lord! No way! Really? Oh my goodness! That was New Zealand? I, wow. Well, he had the same idea as me. So that's going to be a draw, I think. Yeah. He beats me by about, I don't know, like 75, I think. But that's not enough for a win. So it's going to end in a draw. It's my second draw of the season. I guess I'm okay with that. I mean... That seed was horrible. I mean, a remote world, it's... I mean, what do you expect? But... Wow. Yeah, that was a killer. I'm really surprised that was New Zealand, honestly. But um, it was the Uruguay guess, really, that, uh, that got me that draw. So I was really happy with that. Russia was a shame. I maybe should have just guessed in the middle, but it felt Western to me, so... Yeah, uh, all in all... Uh, pretty happy with how that went. I, I'll take a draw against Len. So, yeah, n not going to complain. And Kyrgyzstan. A little worried here. <laughs> I'm not very good at this because I just haven't practiced enough. And it's a it's a country that is actually pretty masterable, no moving. But I have not mastered it. Oh, my goodness. Well, what a start. Um, so... <clears throat> In the little practice that I did, most of the snowy coverage was out around here. So I'm thinking maybe that's what I'm going to try. It's kind of north-south. It curves to the, to the west and continues curving. And it curves to the east down there. Could be something like this. Although, you know, it's not actually, it's not actually impossible. I don't think it's this, but it at least has a chance. Probably something windier like this, isn't it? Guess it's a little more northwest, huh? On second thought, that doesn't really make sense, does it? I'm going to go for it anyway. Uh, oh, are you kidding me? All right, well, I'm in trouble already. He got the road somehow. I mean, 
again, it's probably just a result of practice. Like, he probably has seen that road before or something. I should have known to look over here. I was looking too far west. Okay, not a good start. <clears throat> Round two, we have whatever this is. I don't think I can read that, no. Okay. Well, that's unfortunate. Because I have no clue. I don't know what part of the country looks like this. So I'm just going to guess uh, down here or something. Or. Yeah, down here. Why not? Okay, that's an okay guess. But wrong road. So still behind by a lot. This will be a sick coal. Because it is a very large lake. Uh, I don't know what part. I mean, we're probably, we're maybe more for this kind of area. Coast kind of curves north over there. It's not that though. There's a little bit of room between the road and the lake. Yeah, and the coast just kind of goes north. Is it? Hmm. What is this? Maybe it's just this over here. I'll go here. Okay. Oh, wait, what happened? Where did he go? He must have gone like over here or something. Or maybe he guessed this lake, I'm not sure. <coughs> I didn't expect him to miss that because, well, the lake was right there. He must have just gone on like one side of the lake or something. Okay, well now I'm ahead by a little bit, but it's close. And as usual, I have no idea what's going on. Except there's a lake. <laughs> Oh goodness, it is uh, quite a large uh, point of reference. But where though? The lake is so long, it's like, especially with the North Shore, I feel like I could be anywhere. I don't, oh no, okay, well there's a lot of lake to the west. There's probably a lot of lake to the east as well, but it's not as obvious. Big mountains to the north, but that's kind of true everywhere. Oh no. I just don't know what part of the lake to guess here, to be honest. <clears throat> I don't think there's that much land between me and the lake, but we're also not right on it. Be something like this, perhaps. This kind of area. I kind of like that. Sir, because there's a lot of water to the west. The east, there's water, but it almost looks like it ends. So I feel like we're sort of on the eastern side. Uh, so I'm going to guess where I have it. Am I? Or am I going to go further east? I'm going to go a little further east. I'll go right there. 
Oh, nice. Let's go. He had it about where I had it a second ago. Okay, I'm actually ahead. I didn't expect this, but I'm, I'm, I'm ahead by less than a thousand. So kind of have to pray that this is like downtown Bishkek or something. And it's just a, a nice, easy round to end it. But uh, of course it's not. Oh, man. See, now, now I feel like it's a 50-50 whether I win or not. And the problem is if he's practiced, he might have even like seen this road or something. So this, this could be problematic for me. Because I don't have much here. It's kind of snowy, but it's not as snowy as... I'm used to seeing it. It's kind of northwest. Yeah, this is... Uh, I don't exactly like the way this looks. At all. Did I go that far away? Yeah, I'm just going to go there. I, I have no idea. If he's seen this before, he just wins, which is fine. I mean, he probably deserves it anyway. But hopefully I can... Hopefully he misses it as badly as I do. Because I'm sure I'm not right, but we'll see. Oh. Oh my goodness. <coughs> I had the right road. That's really lucky, honestly. I didn't expect that. But I think I won. I did. Yeah, he got ten points there. Okay, let's let's just quickly check out how this went. Round one, he really nice guess from him. I just yeah, I wasn't gonna compete with that. <clears throat> Round two. Yeah, we were about the same distance away. Round three is interesting. So he did. He, I mean, he did guess on the lake. He probably saw maybe the coast come up to the to the west and he thought it was like this like actually the west shore I don't know um, yeah I'm not sure but uh, yeah I mean it was kind of a risky guess to go all the way over to the west and it didn't quite pay off I was lucky that he did that because I mean otherwise I guess I won by a fair amount but anyway I was happy with this guess because I could sort of tell that the lake was kind of ending to the east. So this this was quite nice. And then round five, he just went for totally different area. And I don't know if you know, I don't know if there's snowy coverage or not over there, but I feel like that guess makes sense. I, I don't I don't know exactly what that area looks like, but it doesn't seem unreasonable. Anyway, really happy to be able to get away with a win in a country that I do not know super well, uh, despite like my profile picture and everything. I'm not actually a Kyrgyzstan expert, although maybe I should become one. Uh, but that's going to do it for me. That's a draw and a win, which is perfectly fine by me. I uh, should climb me out of the relegation zone, and hopefully in the next few weeks I can keep performing, or at the very least stay out of the relegation zone. Um, and yeah, sorry to have missed last week, but I should not be missing any uh, further weeks, so... Looking forward to those. All right. Thank you, everybody, for watching, and goodbye.